Our scattered siren blade through this weapon's old name as the dragging through the mud fall behind out. Now that you, you recast it with skill and precision, why not give it a new name too? Uh, you own a big sword. Reaper of Nexus Modder. I swear this has to be a reference to Nexus mods. Uh, imaginary intrakinetic portable tactical laser cannon. <laughs> Let's go with that one. Yeah, what's this laser cannon about? Uh, imaginary intrakinetic portable tactical laser cannon. But based on my screenplay, it should be called Star Shattering Blade of Truth. Who says the Star Shattering Blade of Truth can actually be a laser cannon? The market is saturated with born superhero immersion. The audience wants something new. Out with the old and in with the new. Let's use imaginary intrakinetic portable tactical laser cannon here and give them a bit of sci fi shock. How about it, Sinian? Are you more interested in selling us the script? Are you aren't interested? Fine, you two are simply too much. If imaginary intrakinetic portable laser cannon is what you want, then port imaginary intrakinetic portable laser cannon it is. Imaginary intrakinetic portable laser cannon reborn once more, suddenly in our Rose's hand, who suddenly felt invincible. With the dragon oil elixir flowing internally and Vidihara High Elder's power protecting externally, our hero gripped onto this small destroying divine blade, imaginary intrakinetic portable laser tactical laser cannon. God, that name's a mouthful. <laughs> this, at this time, there is only one thought in Wild Rose's head. The Lord of Avatar must be destroyed so that Sandra can remain in peace. Stay tuned for next time. <laughs>